you hear is the sound of a DC R&B veteran in the house today, Lady Mary and her in the house band. She's an honorary member of the DC legendary musicians and she's here today on the sound. I'm Britt Waters and welcome to The Sound. I'm here with a veteran R&B singer, Lady Mary, an honorary member of the DC Legendary Musicians. She's a raw talent. She performs everything. I'm talking R&B, oldies, gospel, southern soul. Thank you so much for coming to The Sound Thank stage. Thank you for having us. We and what is your favorite type of music since you cover it all? Oldies. Really? really? Oldies, yes. I remember my mom used to play it all the time and I love it. All right. right. My for favorite all artists. ages too. Yeah, yes, yes, yeah. yes. And I noticed that the older songs are coming back now today. I like that. Yes, what are you bringing back to us first? I'll take you there by the staple singers. Let's go there. Let's go. <laughs> take it away. All right. <laughs> I said, I know a place, y'all. Ain't nobody crying, oh no. It ain't nobody worried. Ain't no smiley faces. They lying to the races. Said, ain't no smiling faces. 
no smiling faces. They're lying to the races. Oh, yeah, come on, let me take you there. Come on and let me take you there. Mercy now, I'm calling, calling, I'm calling for mercy. Mercy, mercy. Yeah, we're gonna take you there. We're gonna take you there. I'm gonna take it home, y'all. See, they're lying to the races. 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 The races. Here we go. Hey, y'all. I said they're lying to the races. Okay. 
When we come back, I get a chance to sit down and talk to Lady Mary about how she got the name Lady in front of her real name and a lot more when we come back on The Sound. Welcome back to The Sound. I'm Britt Waters here with the talented DC native and R&B veteran Lady Mary. She's performed with very legendary artists. I'm talking about The Temptations, The Intruders, Betty Wright, Clarence Carter, and Gene Chandler. Thank you for being here. I'm with all that company. I'm just glad to be sitting with you. Oh my goodness. I'm glad to be here. <laughs> so tell me how you got the title Lady Mary. Well, I started this band about 25 years ago. It was mm -hmm. Jim Bennett. And I came up and auditioned with the song um, Betty Wright, Tonight is the Night. Yes. And from that point on, he started calling me Lady Mary. That's and it how just I got stuck. It's, it's been there ever since. <laughs> I love it. So you've come such a long way. Yes, I have. Yes. Do you know any artists now that kind of bring that old school sense of music back? Um, the artists that, um, Jimmy Smoove and some mm -hmm. folks like that that's yeah. in the DCLM. Um, legendary musicians they it's a lot of them that you know mm -hmm. that does it and I love singing with them and doing shows with those guys how did you get hooked up with them Reverend Trues there she's in charge of everything basically mm -hmm. and I met her at a show and I've been there ever since wow so it's been like um, a year now so throughout your career what part did DC play in kind of getting you to the next level well, D.C. played a, a big part because that's where I started at, in D.C., mm -hmm. you know, right there in, at church, Southern Baptist, mm -hmm. on First Street Northwest. Wow. And from that point, I tried R&B, and I loved it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I still love my gospel, yes. but I, I love R&B also. So many greats started in the church. I always wonder, when someone sees you, do they always make you call you up to sing on church? Like, you know, one day you were running late and just came to church, they always call you up to sing? They, they want me to sing, but I say, no, I don't want to sing, I don't want to sing. <laughs> and then you just, just surprise them one Sunday. Well, um, no, to tell you the truth, I don't. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> I don't. Okay. I don't. I just yeah. enjoy church when I go. Because mm -hmm. that's my time too. to sit down and watch someone else perform. So, mm -hmm. well, it's not a performance for them, but yeah. I just love to hear them sing gospel. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. And what part did singing in church play in your voice and how you perform now? I'm not sure how I played a part, but I just okay. know my dad was singing on the choir and I said, I want to try this. And I got mm -hmm. on a young adult choir and I've been singing ever since. And I can tell you love it because you're love so it. in your element on stage. Oh. And it's like, I'm having fun with you. When you're okay. performing, when do you know that you got the crowd? Like, what's the response that they give you where you know they're enjoying it? When they holler, go Lady Mary, go Lady Mary. Oh, I love that. <laughs> I'm going to start doing that in your next performance. <laughs> and what song really gets people going? Tonight is the night, Betty Wright, oh, and really? I'll take you there. Staple singles. Are those your favorite songs to those sing? Those my favorite also. Yes. Oh, really? Yes. <laughs> so, do you ever take special requests? Yes, I do. Okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. What's kind of the most requested song? Um. Well, uh, I don't. I'm not, I'm not sure if you know, but it's a Southern soul song called Ooh. "What's Your Mister What Your Name Is." Okay. <laughs> Mister What Your Name What is? Your Name Is. I'm going to hear you before <laughs> that one. So Southern soul singing and, and contemporary R&B, what are the differences? Um, well, Southern soul is a lot of, um, well... Is it more it, of a story? It's, it's a story, yes, it's definitely it. a story. Yeah. Yes, 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 it's definitely, it, it tells a, a story, mm -hmm. a love story, mm -hmm. uh, a cheating story, okay. you know, so... Real yes. life stories, because that happens yes, in yes, real life. Yes, it, yeah. it does, it really does. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now, you've worked with so many great people. Is there someone that you would want to work with right now? If I can get anybody, alive or dead, to join you on the soundstage. Betty Wright. Betty Wright. Betty I like Wright. it. All right, so I'm ready to be like, go Lady Mary. <laughs> so when we come back, it's time to turn up the sound once again with DC's legendary Lady Mary and the Into House Band. So stick around for the sound.
Welcome back to The Sound. Britt Waters here with DC's own Lady Mary and the Into House Band. Now, there's a lot of um, aspiring coming up artists in this area. What's a piece of advice you can give since you've had such a successful career? Well, I think that everyone should just learn to get along and, and just, you know, do togetherness yeah. is, is, is very important. Yes, yeah. yes, it's very important. And I see yes. that you're so involved in here in DC with the local music scene yes. and supporting others, and I love that. Yeah, thank you. What's the next song you have for us? Um, I call it Diamond in the Back, but it's called okay. Be Thankful. Okay. Yes. Well, I'm going to let you perform it, and then I'll pick which one I want to call it. Is that okay? Okay, that's cool. All right, take it <laughs> <All> away. <right. laughs> Make me 
you make me feel so good Cause you know how to make me You make me feel so good Thank you, Gladys Oh, yeah And for all of you watching, we'll see you again on the next edition of The Sound. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you. All right. yeah.